Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a long time since we have done a video and I've got so busy with uh, lots of things. Um, that's what I could not make the video. So here we are with a new topic. I hope you guys enjoy. This is my personal experience and uh, whatever the video I'm talking about, it's my personal experience which I'm sharing it. So um, it could work for the people, it may not work for the people. So it's totally depends on each and every single person. So in case it does not work for you, so don't blame me. <laughs> this is the one. All right. So what is the topic for today? It's all about how I feel being a hotelier. So a uh, little bit background. Again, <laughs> every single video I have a background or I have a history to say. Anyway, uh, I'm in the hotel industry for the last 11 years and uh, Actually, I came to hotel industry for a specific reason because I have done a diploma in aviation um, and I wanted to be a cabin crew all the time when I was very, very young. And um, uh, once uh, I have been through many interviews and they said, you know, it would be great to have uh, some hotel industry um, experience to add on. Uh, to be selected easily to the uh, cabin crew so i thought okay let me just then uh, go and work in the hotels first and then later i can get the experience and apply to uh, aviations and then i found a job after millions of rejections <laughs> i found a job back in chennai in india in obroy hotel i've started uh, being a business center assistant, that's my first hotel job ever. Uh, the job role involves uh, photocopying for the guest and the internet connections because we have uh, computers, the guests can come and have internets and faxes and some uh, meeting rooms as well. So that was the job profile I had. And I've, I was working, working for one year, two years, then I got kind of used to, you know, the hotel industry and I've settled it. And I never applied for aviation afterwards because I started loving the hotel industry so, so, so much. And uh, that's what made me to stay with the industry for 11 years which is a long period and uh, I'm not sure if I can able to work for a different industry because uh, it became my daily routine and this is part of my life yeah I don't I can't think of any other job except the hotel industry so uh, yeah this is this is what uh, my my background was and how I feel to be a hotelier which is a uh, you know uh, amazing question to ask and I would always say I feel so 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 awesome I can't explain in words or which word would be appropriate to say uh, my feeling because I love the hotel industry I love 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 to the core uh, this is not like a machinery this is not like a factory this is not like a very admin job or something this is more of people's you know people job and uh, Literally, you are making people happy and every single day you're making them satisfied and in so many ways and the people smile at you and say um, My stay was great because of you and I'm coming back because of you which gives a you know the, the, the fantastic feeling I don't think so it can ever um, Can get from others it Could be every 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 profile for uh, every profession for people I'm sure they have their own things to enjoy but being a hotel it is all about the people and um, it is such a great and fantastic fun industry to work for i would say so i have some of my paper steps here i'm going to talk about and then i'll tell you um, these points uh, this is what i feel and um, uh, being a hotelier and i enjoy work every single day i, I just love it um, i've i've ha i have a strong background in front office i have worked um, around um, maybe six years in front office and I also worked with FMB I've also worked with banqueting and uh, meeting rooms and poll rooms bookings and everything um, I haven't worked in kitchen <laughs> I don't think so you can ever work in kitchen and uh, but mainly yes front office was my um, strong background in the hotel industry so um, Let's get started. So I have here the first point being a hotelier. I feel it is so most enjoyable job ever. I enjoy talking to people, giving service to them, being very customer service oriented. oriented. I, I love 
to do that. So uh, this is um, something which is very enjoyable for me to do every single day. And oh, I'm, I'm running short of breath. Okay. So, and this is a people job. So you're dealing with people constantly. You're not dealing with machines or anything like the others. So people, people, people. This is what it is all about and uh, which makes it great because you get to meet so many different nationalities, so many different cultures. You learn so many things. So uh, this is a great point being a hotelier and uh, the satisfaction and the happiness you get out of making somebody happy um, that's something amazing so that's what I feel as a hotelier and uh, this is an everyday operation you know it's not like you keep continuing the same thing today till next month or six months projects or something it's like daily you meet the guest you have so many things to deliver different different guests are there so every day it's a, it's a different day and uh, every day the people are different the guests are different so uh, which is great fun and uh, you get to make some tips if you make the guest happy and uh, i have made uh, lots of learned lots of tips um uh, when I, I used to be a junior my motive is only two things uh, towards the customer service which is one is to uh, uh, you know one is to see my name on the comments card because we have a comments card every single guest used to fill when i used to be in front of office so i want my name to be there every single comments card so that was one of my motive and the second thing is obviously to get a good tips which i was making it at that time so fantastic and the next thing is <clears throat> Um, you get to meet some um, special people as well, like celebrities and things, depends upon the hotel you work for. I have met with many. I have met with uh, football players, I met with uh, Bollywood actors, I have met with some sports players uh, in cricket and uh, quite some people. Yeah, it is very interesting. And uh, still yet, you have to keep the professionalism. You can't just go and jump, hey, it's a Bollywood actor, Shah Khan or whoever, no. Yet, you have to keep the professionalism. And um, you get to meet million different people, yes, and their attitude and things like that. So you obviously um, know to handle people more. So that's being a hotelier, you learn that. And uh, for myself, I have learned English, how to talk English through the hotel industry because you get to talk to so many people and uh, um, you know your english and your communications improve plus uh, right now we work in dubai and you get to learn so many different languages here because we have roughly maybe 200 nationalities plus so this is a great 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 uh, way um, for the um, uh, hotel industry and being a hotelier so those are the points from my side i love working for the industry and probably i would retire with the industry <laughs> and uh, yeah I totally feel absolutely amazing to work for hotel industry and uh, I would really encourage people to do that and if you are a people person if you're not probably then you may end up in a wrong industry so uh, we will uh, so uh, make the right choice and um, yeah that's it from my side and we'll see you on my next video and uh, keep enjoying your work and we'll see you soon bye